Hey cryptocurrency market, it's Denny Lovejoy, your favorite blockchain tutorial, Jedi Master, and in this video I'm sharing with you how to set up a Horizon wallet. So the first step here is to find the correct domain name. So I'll go ahead and show you how I do that. In my browser I go to coinmarketcap.com and go ahead and search that. And in the search here I could go ahead and type in Horizon and Horizon is spelled with an E. So go ahead and click that. And it takes us to this cryptocurrency here. And their first link here is their website. So we're gonna go ahead and click that. And it takes us to horizon.global right here. So go ahead and search that if you want to. Horizon.global. Horizon is spelled H O R I. Z E N dot global and if you do type it in yourself just make sure you don't misspell anything and verify it's connected to an HTTPS website and also verify it's secure by checking if it has this green padlock right here and if I click it it says secure connection so we're good there and the second way you can find their website is by going on their Twitter so I'll show you how I do that too I'm going to go back to the Horizon coin market cap here and I'm going to scroll down to these tabs and I'm going to click social here next to charts and markets and what happens is it takes us to their Twitter profile so I could go ahead and click this and this is the Twitter for Horizon. Take note of how many followers they have. They have almost 24,000 followers and in their description here they're promoting horizon.global which is the same website so it's confirmed this is a good website to go on and this is the official website so I can exit out of here along with Twitter and CoinMarketCap and we're gonna move on to step number two which is to choose the correct wallet I'll show you how to do that on the top of the page here it says get a wallet next to buy Zen. So go ahead and click this button right here, get a wallet. And it directs us to their official wallets here. So they have a Windows, Mac, Linux, a web wallet, Android, and paper wallet. Before we download any of these wallets, I do want to let you know that the official Horizon wallets are highly recommended for everyone and they're developed and maintained by the Horizon core development team. So at this point in the video, what you want to go ahead and do is choose the appropriate download for you. I'll be choosing the Light Client for Mac OS. And if you're using Windows or Linux, go ahead and choose the Light Client as well. And the reason why I'm choosing the Light Client is because most people don't really need to download a full copy of the blockchain. From what I'm aware of, most users are just looking to send and receive the cryptocurrency and don't necessarily need to download the full blockchain. So what I'm gonna do here is click light client right here. And that's starting to download. So go ahead and wait for that to download. It's gonna take about four or so minutes. Feel free to pause the video now and recontinue it once it's done downloading for you. So great, it downloaded and we're gonna move on to the next step which is to install the wallet and all you have to do is click this button right here which is Arizon and it's gonna start opening right now and here it is so we're gonna drag this Arizon app into our applications here and I'm gonna try opening it by double clicking it and it says are you sure you want to open it I'm gonna say yes and here's the wallet so it says on the top here wallet name I could go ahead and choose my name and it's asking me for a password here so quick pro tip on passwords on our team we use password managers the one that we use is keypass.info that's a free and open source password manager and it's actually mandatory that you use this. 
what you're gonna do is get your password from your password manager because it auto generates a very strong password for you which you don't have to memorize and all you would have to do is copy and paste the password that they give you and paste it into here to create the new account so again get your password from your password manager and then copy and paste that into here and once you do that you're gonna go ahead and click create wallet and it says here on the top to make sure that you will never lose your wallet make sure to keep a backup of your wallets if you are not sure please refer to the Arizon manual for further information by pressing I understand you declare that you understand this for further information please refer to the help menu of Arizon so I'm gonna go ahead and click OK and now it's asking me for my wallet name and my password so again, go to your password manager for this and go get your password from your password manager to log in and then go ahead and click this, which says log in. And here's the Horizon wallet. So as you can see on the top, it says overview and then there's a deposit button right next to it. And then there's a withdraw button. Above it, it says batch withdraw, batch split, paper wallet, import private key. So interesting enough, this website is actually giving me a list of addresses I could use. And it looks like it's all for Zen here and that they're all unnamed and that if I click on it, it gives me an opportunity to choose a name so I could choose for example account one and then I could pretty much create as many accounts that I wish so that's great and this public address right here what I could do is copy and paste that and if I go to deposits here and click two and then paste my address in, into here and then I could choose the amount, for example, and I could save the QR code. So as far as accounts go, all you really need is this public address right here. You at least need one, and on this list, it gives you as many as you want. So that's good to know. So here is your public address, which you could share. In this video, I am not sharing with you how to send, receive, backup, protect, or even update the wallet. I just wanted to show you how to download and install it. And there's one more thing that I wanna share with you, which is to verify that you can open and close the wallet. That's step number five. So I'll show you how to open and close it. If you look at my screen here, I'll drag it to the top left. And what I'm gonna do is click on this horizon right here and it says quit horizon i'll go ahead and do that and it disappears and the way to confirm that it's disconnected from your computer is by going to your finder and going under devices here and what you're going to want to do is click this eject button for horizon and it disappears again and the proper way to reopen it is to go back to your finder go to your applications find Horizon inside that folder, right click, and then click open. And it says, are you sure you wanna open it? Click open. And here it is one more time. So remember to log in, leverage your password manager. Again, the one we use is keypass.info and copy and paste your password from your password manager to log in. And once you do that, go ahead and click log in. And here we are again, back inside the wallet. So great, you successfully downloaded and installed a Horizon wallet, and specifically, you downloaded the Horizon wallet. So that concludes my video. If you like watching blockchain tutorials like this, get the cryptocurrency investing blueprint. You could learn more at cryptocurrency.market slash blueprint, and you could get 10% off using my promo code Denny2018. Check out the display address on the screen here or check out the links below.
You could also follow me on Twitter. My handle is Denny Lovejoy. And thank you so much for watching my blockchain tutorial on how to set up a Horizon wallet. If you have any suggestions or comments for future videos, go ahead and leave me a comment below or send me a message on Twitter. Again, thanks for watching. Have a terrific day, and I'll see you on the next blockchain tutorial.